truly think that there is no other place like Eugene in the entire United States. So of course, there are some important things that you're gonna wanna consider if you're thinking about making a move to Eugene. My name is Hannah Caldwell and I'm a local real estate agent. And I'm gonna tell you the things that I think are the most important when you're considering making a move to Eugene. First thing that I wanna talk about is culture. Eugene is a really unique. It's not a big city. It's not a small town. The population is somewhere around 175,000 people, but it still retains that small town feel. You don't feel like you're in a bunch of commotion all the time. There's not a ton of traffic. It's really, really special, but it's still big enough that there is so much to do. There is a huge emphasis on arts and entertainment in our culture. There's the Holt Performing Arts Center. There's the Eugene Opera. There's the Oregon Bach Festival. There's so much for people that are interested in arts and culture. I also think that Eugene does an amazing job at celebrating diversity. We have organizations, we have events, we have activities that are all celebrating the diversity in Eugene. We have the Asian night market, there's salsa dancing in Kesey Square. So if you're looking to get involved or to learn, there's a great opportunity for that in Eugene. And of course, you can't talk about the culture of Eugene without mentioning that it is a university town. And it's not just a university town. It's the home of the Oregon Ducks. You may not have heard of it, but I bet you, you have. There is nothing like seeing a college football game at Autzen Stadium. Duck football is a huge part of Eugene culture. It's so much fun. There really is no experience like it. So if you are a college sports fan, this is a great place for you. If you're not, that's something that you're gonna wanna think about if you're considering moving here. Of course, you have to talk about the cost of living if you're considering moving to Eugene because it is high. My husband just sent me an article the other day that said that Eugene is in the top 25 of most expensive cities in the United States, which I believe. You know, I think that a lot of that is to do with our cost of housing. Housing is expensive in Eugene and there's a multitude of reasons for it. But the biggest one is the fact that we have no new construction happening, almost. And that's due to years and years of city planning. But what it's caused is high demand and low inventory. And that just continues to push housing prices up and up and up. The cost of buying a house has in turn caused the cost of renting a house to be super high as well your housing cost is definitely gonna be the biggest part of your budget when you're thinking about moving to Eugene. I read an article recently that said that if you're a single person living in Eugene, you're gonna need a salary of 50 to $60,000 just to cover your basic cost of living. So this is definitely something that you're gonna to wanna to consider before making a move. In relation to cost of living, we also need to talk about the job market. Some people say that the job market is really strong in Eugene. Some people say that it's not. The thing to know is that there is a lot of different interest industries in Eugene. There's tons of food manufacturing. There is still timber. There's technology. There is medical. There is finance. So there is a lot of opportunity for jobs in Eugene. It just is because the way that our city is structured, the jobs are not easy to come by. So if you're thinking about making a move to Eugene, consider having a job lined up before you make the move. We also need to talk about the weather. Whenever somebody talks about Eugene, they love to talk about the weather because lots of people say it's just rain and gloom all year long. And I'm not gonna say that it doesn't rain here. It definitely does. And I do not like the rain. But what I will say is that Eugene has pretty much four distinct seasons. We have a gorgeous summer. It's not sweltering hot. You can be outside enjoying all that Oregon has to offer. We also have fall, which still can be really beautiful. And because Oregon is so green most of the time, in fall, you get all of the beautiful color changes with the deciduous trees, and it's really stunning. You do start to get the rain, and when we talk about winter, it's gonna be rain and gloom for pretty much three months straight. I would say the good news is if you're coming from the north, 
we don't have a lot of snow, maybe two days to a week, a year at most. I will say that when it does snow, we're not really prepared and the city usually shuts down, but it's a good thing that it's not very much of the year. And then spring is also really lovely. Again, a lot of rain, but it causes so much to bloom and it really is beautiful. All of the flowers are in bloom, everything turns green. Spring is a really lovely time of year. So if you're considering making a move to Eugene, yes, it may be quite different from the climate that you're used to. Maybe it's gonna snow much less and that's great. Maybe it's gonna be cooler and that could also be great. Maybe it's gonna be a lot more rainy and that's not gonna be so great. So make sure you consider all of these things before you make your move. If you're moving here with a family, then you're probably gonna wanna consider education. And I think that when we're talking about schools, the schools in Eugene are really great. We have a great public school system and it has a lot to offer. There's French immersion, Spanish immersion, Chinese immersion. Lots of our public high schools have what's called international high school that puts a really high emphasis on cultural studies. So when you're talking about public schools, you have a lot of great options. But if you don't wanna go the public school route, there's also a lot of private options or alternative options like Montessori or Waldorf. So I think that when you're talking about education and moving to Eugene, there's going to be something for you no matter what you're looking for. Eugene is also one of the most bike-friendly cities in the entire United States. That being said, most people will still say that Eugene is car dependent. We do have amazing, amazing bike paths. You can get from one end of the city to another solely on bike, on a protected bike path, and it is lovely. There's bike paths that go right by the Willamette River, and it is a great way to get around, especially if you are close to the downtown area. But like I said, you're still probably gonna wanna have a car. So that's something to consider when you're thinking about moving to Eugene. Of course, another amazing, amazing thing, probably my favorite thing about Eugene to consider is the proximity to outdoor recreation. It is incredible. We are so centrally located that we have mountains and skiing and snowboarding less than an hour and a half away. We have the beach also an hour and a half away. In town alone, we have so much hiking, like at Spencer's Butte, but if you go even an hour or two hours outside of Eugene, there's more hiking than you will be able to do in your entire life. There's also so much other outdoor recreation. There's sailing at Fern Ridge Lake, there's rock climbing at Smith Rock and Bend. There's whitewater rafting on the Willamette River or the Mackenzie River or the Rogue River or the Umpqua. Like the options are endless. So there's definitely something for everyone in terms of outdoor recreation within super close proximity to Eugene. It's gotta be one of my favorite things about living in Eugene. Another thing to consider when you're moving to Eugene is that Eugene puts a strong emphasis on sustainability. This means that all of our electricity comes from rene renewable energy, but it also means that there are some city policies that are changing, looking towards a greener future, but one that's coming is the ban of natural gas. So if you are a gas stove girly, you love to cook with gas, this is something that you're gonna wanna consider when you're thinking about moving to Eugene. The solution will be that you can put an above ground propane tank, but, there is going to continuously be city policy moving towards a sustainable future. We pay 10 cents for grocery bags at the grocery store. These are the things that, in terms of sustainability, you'll wanna consider. Last thing that is really, really, really important to consider when you're thinking about moving to Eugene is, will there be a sense of community? And guess what? I can almost guarantee you that you will be able to find community in Eugene and partially because the city does a really good job of fostering that. The city of Eugene has programs, free programs for arts, for entertainment, for outdoor recreation, where you can go and meet people and create a community. There's so many activities, there's so many interest groups available in Eugene, and the community loves to bring people in and have people be a part of it. So if you're considering making the move, please send me an email. I would love to help you find a home. If you like this video, give it a thumbs up and subscribe to the channel for more information about Eugene. And I'll see you next time.